right, everyone. Well, time for the final episode of Review of the Day, which is Clash of the Tridents. So, let's take a look at it. Guidance counselor Rebecca James, who used to date Keith, has gone to Veronica to come in for a grief therapy session because of a study she is doing. During the session, Veronica plants a stapler with a microphone on the desk. Meanwhile, Sheriff questions a student, Rick, on his fake IDs. When questioned further, Rick says that Veronica made the IDs, although she did not. During a locker check, Sheriff Lamb finds blank IDs spilling out of her locker, as well as four in her purse. Veronica is arrested and taken down to the station. At the station, Veronica confronts Rick. Rick says that an unspecified they forced him to blame Veronica. Later, Logan walks through the hallway and faces scorn and stares from the other students because of the incident with his father. Weevil talks to Rebecca while Veronica listens to her car radio. Rebecca shows proof that Weevil and Lily were dating. Veronica wonders why Lily didn't tell Veronica about her relationship with Weevil. Veronica meets with Rick in secret, and Rick tells her that a secret society called the Tridents decided to blame her. He is a recent inductee who is trying to get on their good side. Rick also tells Veronica that Duncan is part of the group. Veronica puts a tracker on Duncan's car. Logan is suspended for a fight that broke out in school. Keith and Cliff tell Veronica that Rick's friend, that Rick's friend Tim's family is suing Veronica and Keith because they believe that Veronica created the fake IDs. Later, Wells tells Veronica that he heard that a mystery locker at school dispenses fake IDs if the participant pays $250. Veronica positions the camera in order to watch the locker 24-7. Rebecca talks to Logan and Veronica hears over the radio. Logan says that he blames Veronica for Lily's death. Veronica and Wallace track Duncan to a mysterious location, which turns out to be a club. Veronica finds Duncan and asks him who the leader is, but he doesn't give, any, doesn't give anything up. Soon afterwards, Duncan brings Veronica a message from the Great Triton, and she has to do karaoke on stage in order to elicit a response from the Triton leader. After the song, she meets with a supposed leader, but it's actually an imposter who reveals that a prank has been played on Veronica. Meanwhile, Rick has become targeted by the Tridents, who threaten him. Veronica hears Duncan's conversation with Rebecca. Duncan states that he has forgotten the day 